sad like it's just all the people getting dropped off and the people standing outside hugging them and people crying and i look i saw the people crying and my eyes started hey. <laughs> started watering i was like mm -mm, mm -mm, nope won't get me i was about to turn the camera on and i had to wait <laughs> won't get me yeah i do not want to start crying mm -mm. What's wrong, XJ? You sad? Yeah. Why? Yeah, my chest hurt. Like my, <laughs> my heart is really like feel like it's cramping or being squeezed. It's and I ain't even left yet. I don't even want to leave. <laughs> My chest is really hurting. enough to come talk to y'all about today and it's not that I've been like hysterically crying or any of that it's just that I've been sad haven't been crying just been sad in my feelings a little bit but today was deployment day for my husband so we went to the family um I think it was like a send-off ceremony that they had for them where they have close family was able to come and spend a little bit of time with them before they left, listen at what the higher ups had to say and watch them fly away on the plane. Um, it was a, an emotional and a sad day for everybody out there. Um, lots of kids, lots of Pregnant spouses and partners. It was a lot. And I was able to hold down my tears until I saw other people crying. And I dropped a few, but it was just like, done. I couldn't know. Me having none of that. But ultimately, it was a good day. It was nice. Um,. Just sad. I'm gonna miss him. I already missed him. Um, but they'll be back. They will be back. Before we know it, in the blink of an eye, I've been praying, praying, praying since we found out this was even happening last year. So I know God got him, got him, and I, his 
I, I call them unit buddies. I don't know what they're called, but God has them all in his hands and he will bring them through. He will bring us through, the ones of us that are over here waiting. And we'll get through this. And before we know it, time will be up. But, um, yeah, yeah, I'll just pray for us. Stay and support me if you like. Give me a, go ahead and subscribe and stay to support me because I'm going to need all the distractions possible. Yeah. And just so y'all know, this video is pre-recorded so whenever i post it just know that the deployment happened weeks ago um this is not the day of the night of i'm talking like it is because physically right now this is the night of it happening but when i post the video it will not have happened recently <laughs> it'll be weeks before i post this video um or any content related to it. So, yeah. And maybe by then I'll be more up on my game by then after a few weeks. But y'all just pray for us. Keep me in your prayers. Keep them in your prayers. Our family, all the other families and soldiers. And yeah, just stay, join the family. Help support me. Help keep me distracted. Um, yeah, that's it, y'all. It's, it's different. Yep, so I'm going to go. <laughs> Before I start crying. So, I will see y'all when I pick up the camera again. You want me to show you first? Yeah. <laughs> this time. Hmm? My turn. My turn? Yeah. Okay. I need to talk first. Okay, you want to talk first? Go ahead. Yeah, you need to talk first. I talk first? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Hey, y'all. So it's officially, no, yesterday was officially day one of um, my husband's deployment. Yeah. Like him actually being gone. Yeah. Um, but like I, like I said previously, this video is weeks old by now. By the time I post it, it'll be weeks old. But right now I'm talking in the present day, but it'll be weeks old by the time I post it. Um, but yeah, y'all. Yesterday was um, day one. I took the kids to my in-laws house. Spent some time with them yesterday. Um, it was a chill day. Um, everything was fine. You know, I'm keeping a positive mindset. Still, I mean, of course you have your feelings still sad, but keeping a positive mindset. Um, yeah. I'm a very mental person, so I have to keep a positive mindset to not let myself get in the slumps and get super upset. So that's why I'm trying to stay focused on keeping a positive mindset. And my babies help me do that. They keep me laughing. Um, when they're not, you know, being typical babies and toddlers, um, having tantrums and stuff like that. But yeah, y'all, it's been fun. My thing is, we feed off my husband and I. We feed off each other. So as long as he's up, he's fine. I'm fine. As long as I'm fine, he's fine. So we're both fine. He's in positive spirits. So I'm in positive spirits. I'm fine. Um, so my mama been crying, and I ain't even been crying. So 
Um, I told her, I was like, you need to stop. Because if I ain't crying, nobody shouldn't be crying. <laughs> but she been crying since, what, Saturday? Um, but yeah, y'all, so I can't remember about XJ to speech. We're about to leave. I stopped at Starbucks here and sat in the parking lot and drank me a coffee because I'm tired, y'all. I am so tired. We've been on the road all weekend up until now, every day up until now. And I'm just tired. I just want to, when I get back to the house, I just want to relax. I don't want to do too much of anything. Um, I just want to relax. I need to wash my hair. Been, it, it has needed to be washed for weeks now, but I've been putting it off. And I'm going to wait till tomorrow because I don't feel like it and I'm tired. So I don't want to, you know rip my hair out and stuff so i'm gonna wait till tomorrow to try to start fresh with washing my hair but um Ma, hmm no you can't sit up here we're about to start driving but um i was trying to think of a catchy like okay. title for my blogs <laughs> and i was like at first i was like surviving deployment I was like, no, that sounds too miserable. So I'm trying to think of a catchy um, name for this vlog series because I'm going to keep it on the whole time he's gone. So, yeah, as long as he's gone, as long as he's gone, it's a piece of us missing, a piece of our family missing. So that's why I want to make it a series until he comes home. But, um,. Yeah, y'all, that's it. I just wanted to check in. I didn't feel like picking up the camera yesterday. I was tired. Um, yeah, I was tired. And I didn't feel like picking up the camera, so I said I'll wait till today. I didn't feel like picking up this morning because we kind of running behind. And so I said I'll pick it up now while I was sitting in the parking lot drinking my coffee, which I'm done. But try to give me some type of energy because I'm really tired. Um... Put your arms back in your seatbelt. Put your arms back in your seatbelt. You heard me. Ma'am. Put your arms back in your seatbelt. Put your arms back in your seatbelt. Extra. You hear, you hear me. What? Put your arms back in your seatbelt. Okay, he's just about to show out, but um, yeah, I'm just tired. Like, <laughs> I'm so tired. I go to bed really late. I go to bed at like, and when I say go to bed, like I'm in the bed before this time, but I don't usually like cut my TV off. Uh, put my phone on the dresser for me to actually try to go to sleep until like three, four, sometimes even five o'clock in the morning. And last night, well, this morning it was four o'clock in the morning when I actually attempted to go to sleep. But I'm tired. Um, y'all, I'm gonna say it again. I'm I'm still losing weight. Like I'm, I'm so excited about this. I put on this shirt today. This is a shirt that my mother-in-law gave me for Mother's Day. She made it for me and gave it to me. And y'all, when she first gave it to me, it was tight on me. Like it was no room in there, no room at all. And I put it on today, and it's loose, y'all. I got so much room and space in here. I feel comfortable in it, not self-conscious, y'all. Still 11 pounds down and going, y'all. So excited. <laughs> But I'm going to come back to y'all when we um, figure out what we are going to do. What else we're going to do. Probably won't be much today because, like I said, I am tired. I'm tired. And y'all know we have a homebody vlog series. So I'm, I'm, I'm a homebody Bye. for sure. And that's what it's going to be today. That's what it's going to be given today. Because once we get back in the house, that's it. Um, at least that's what I plan now, you know. 
Y'all know I'm living with my mama and my grandma right now. So my mama can think of stuff off the top of her head she want me to do at the, at the break, drop of a dime. I do need to take some flooring back to the carpet store and return it. And get my money back because we didn't use it. Will I do that today or tomorrow? I don't know. Yeah, I'm just tired. We'll see y'all when we get to the house. Because I'm just rambling.